hello from the studios at Pascual Bravo University. I am Gary Vernier and this is World News Report. A giant prehistoric shark, previously thought to be extinct for more than 20 million years, has been captured by local fishermen off the coast of Pakistan, reports the Islamabad Herald this morning. The giant creature, first thought to be a great white shark, was rapidly declared by experts to be an unknown species of shark, and its great weight and size were unheard of. Analysis of the teeth suggests the shark to be a relative of the megalodon, an extinct species of shark that lived approximately 2.8 to 1.5 million years ago during the Cenozoic era. The sea creature that measures an incredible 10.4 meters and weighs an outstanding 15.6 tons is the largest living shark ever caught to date. More than 20 local fishermen and heavy machinery were needed to haul the giant beast onto the shore. Smithsonian Institute researcher Jeff Mayer says this is the catch of a lifetime and was highly unexpected. This is an incredible opportunity to work on a real specimen instead of trying to figure out the whole picture from different fossil composites, admits Smithsonian paleontologist Jeff Mayer, visibly enthused by the discovery. The specimen was revealed not to be fully grown and is estimated to be two or three years old and already twice the size of a full-grown white shark, which takes five years to reach its full growth. A quick autopsy revealed the creature lives under great depths, feeding on giant squid and other fish not commonly found near the surface, which makes the discovery even more incredible to experts. The giant sea creature had a total of 276 teeth in its jaws, spanning five rows with its biggest tooth measuring an incredible 15 centimeters. The recent discovery has raised great enthusiasm from experts abroad who are pondering the fact that others thought to be extinct species might still be dwelling in the depths of the seas. This is very exciting news for the future of ocean exploration as technology is permitting us to go deeper and deeper every day, explains marine biologist Susan Chopper from the University of Sydney, Australia. I just don't know how well our submarines would do against a giant monster like this, she adds. This has been a World News Report. Good day. Alcaldía de Medellín cuenta con vos.